this video, we are going to be doing some division. And hopefully at the end of this video, you will understand how to divide a little better. Okay, so we have 65 divided by 5. So the first thing we want to do, if you have it set up like this, is set it up like this. The second number always goes on the outside of the box. And the first number always goes on the inside of the box. Just like that. First thing you want to do is see how many times can 5 go into 6. It can only go in one time. So you want to put the 1 directly over the 6. Next, you multiply. 5 times 1 is 5. And you put it directly under the 6. Next step is subtraction. 6 minus 5 is 1. Okay. Now, how many times can 5 go into 1? It can't. So that means you're going to have to bring down the 5. So now you have 15. How many times can 5 go into 15? Three times. So you want to write the 3 right above the 5. Now you want to multiply again. 5 times 3 is 15. And now you want to subtract. 15 minus 15 is 0. And once you get to 0, you're done. So 65 divided by 5 is 13. Simple as that. Next we have 735 divided by 7. So again, we want to set it up. The second number goes on the outside, and the first number goes on the inside. 735. How many times can 7 go into 7? One time. So you put the 1 directly over the 7. Now multiplication, 7 times 1, that's 7. And now we subtract. 7 minus 7 is 0. But we still have these numbers over here, so we can't stop. So how many times can 7 go into 0? It doesn't. So you have to bring down the 3. How many times can 7 go into 3? It doesn't. So you put the 0 right above the 3. But we still have this number over here. So now we bring down the 5. So now we need to find out how many times 7 can go into 35. 7 goes into 35 5 times. Now we need to do 7 times 5. And that brings you to 7 times 5 brings you to 35. 35 minus 35 is 0. And since there are no other numbers over here and your number is at 0, you're done. So 735 divided by 7 is 105. And you're done.